Hi, it's me again with Corel Draw Tips and Tricks, and this is the second part of over the top, I'm going to call them name tags, and if you didn't watch the first video, you won't really understand. But if you if you did take the time to draw this, and it would save you, I forgot to mention in the first video, not only would it save you time, it would save you a little bit of wood. Because you're going to, these things are so close, and it's not going to be double cutting the line, because each one of these lines is separately. Now, with that said, if you had this template, let's say, and kept it as a file, there's no way to take your names and put them in the center. There's no snap to because that's not a center of anything. So a good remedy to that would be to take your Smart Fill tool and put it just on a light gray and fill that in and move it out of the way. Now that is actually an object and it will snap to the center. Then you can just take and move it back that three inches and those texts are in the center of that name badge. And you could do that multiple times and uh, it's a pretty quick and easy way. You know, even if you never make the name tags, that's a good way to center something on a, on a badge itself or any object or to center a graphic doesn't have to be a name or anything. You can use a smart fill tool and use your nudge factor to move it out of the way a certain amount of, you know, inches, just get it off the screen, just as long as you use the same one to put it back. Anyway, I hope that helped a little bit, and thank you for watching.